Participants of No Shave November aren't your typical Grizzly Adams. For Kimberly Lidell, No Shave November is a good excuse for her to forget about dealing with the hassle of shaving while having fun with her friends. Makes me feel less of an anomaly when there's a group of people also participating and it's fairly a well-known concept. It's not very unusual anymore. People are just like, oh, it's No Shave November, so it's okay. Participants typically shave the last day of October and don't shave or trim until December. The origin of No Shave November is unknown, but that doesn't stop students from participating year after year. My beard has just evolved over time this last few years, so I decided just to, why not do it and just compare the, my freshman year No Shave to my sophomore year No Shave to this year's No Shave. So, Despite setbacks from itchiness, students have shown their support for No Shave November this year. There's actually quite a few that have participated, surprisingly. Camp Penner, HC Media.